This is Hobby King's new La Bella Dame, or Pretty Lady, uh, 1080 millimeter EPO foam, three channel, old timer style RC airplane. Some models, you know, just look like they're gonna fly good right off the drawing board, and La Bella Dame is one of them. Before the days of gyro stabilization and uh, digital electronic control, models were aerodynamically designed for maximum stability. She features a polyhedral wing and a pylon mounted wing, uh, which is uh, a lot like the old timer designs, gives you a lot of good stability, a lot of good lateral stability about the longitudinal axis. So as the airplane gets upset by wind gusts, the polyhedral helps and the pylon mounted wing helps to right the airplane. Three channels, only rudder, elevator, and throttle. Very easy model to assemble. Uh, just get your batteries charged first because you're going to have this thing put together before your batteries are done charging. All you got to do is screw the uh, tail feathers and the wings on. Right now I'm a little concerned about center of gravity. Might be a little tail heavy. She's balancing right here on the wing tips. Not only does this model have some cool old timer looks to her, but she's also got some sleek modern touches like this carbon fiber rod attaching the tail and a really clean design on the fuselage and nose spinner. Under the canopy here it's a rather tight fit. Magnet uh, mounted canopy with a little tab in the back and you see there's just room for the battery. It calls for a 1300 um, a 1300 two cell battery and I've just got room in here for a 750 two cell battery with a JST connector. Beneath that I managed to cram in an orange uh, receiver and there's your two servos, rudder and elevator. Under here is a 10 amp ESC and the motor provided is a 80 watt brushless motor. So all you need to provide for this model is the receiver and the transmitter and your battery. I've set the control rods up to their outermost position for maximum throw as it's a very stable model and um, in case there's any trim problems I want that uh, maximum throw. The only uh, concern is that the uh, tail came out slightly crooked. Uh, they didn't get the carbon fiber rod, rod clocked in exactly the 12 o'clock position. We want to triple check the control throws one more time before the maiden flight. Back stick, up elevator, forward stick, down elevator, left rudder, right rudder. And I've got the rudder mounted here on the right stick, which would normally be the aileron control for a four-channel airplane. And then over here, of course, is your throttle. Super easy to fly. Yeah. It's got a pretty clean aerodynamic design, so it's got a lot of penetration. When you come into land, you got to cut the power way back. It's got a very flat glide angle. Half throttle. Nice no wind morning, frosty morning. Watch out for those trees right there. With that tail skid, it's not going to um, steer very much when she's on the ground. 
Very easy, very stable, fun to fly flying machine. You take the landing gear off of her and she really glides well. With that wing platform, it, it reminds me of uh, the old Thermic B Jetco gliders I flew as a kid. It's like having a radio control uh, ther Thermic B model airplane. The landing gear <laughs> proved to be a little more brittle than I thought. I did manage to uh, snap the carbon fiber rod off <clears throat> on a, uh, well, stall, stall landing. But with the landing gear off, it's a lot of fun just to fly the thing and hand catch it. Just like that, real easy. And with the great gliding characteristics of this model, the 750 milliamp battery pl provides plenty of flying time. You can put her up there in a glide and get her to thermal real good on a warm day. She doesn't climb like a homesick angel, but that's what gives you the lightweight and good thermaling capability. Power off, trimmed up, left hand pattern. Nice and stable. Not a hint of stalling or bobbling. Shave the grass on that one. A little worried about nicking the prop on the grass. Oof. Remember that old movie, The Great Waldo Pepper, where the director's yelling at Waldo to fly lower to the camera, closer to the camera. <laughs> That's what we got going here today. Look at that glide. She steers just fine, rudder only, like a real airship. An airship of the past. A little U control. I gotta turn around the other way. Unscrew yourself.
your eye out. When I was a lad, I was a little bit shy. Something came along, caught my eye. When I heard the jazz band strike up.